Hi, my name is Oliver from Position Property. I'm going to take you on a video tour of this home and point out the many important features and benefits available to you should you rent this property. Let's go and take a look. This is the building we're looking at. Mayfair Apartments, Seville. The front of the complex. Taking you up the entrance either via this ramp or we come up the front of the building here to the front foyer and let's make our way through the front doors security system and intercon system to get in or use a key now just at this complex here, this is the main foyer of walking into the building. There's actually a, like a library area here, a, a communal shared library. People put their books in and you can exchange them. That's going up towards the pool area and back around to the entrance of the property. So this is just the body corporate communal areas for the building and around to the lift here. But we're going to have a quick sticky peek at the gymnasium area. We've got a couple of little items in here. So it's not really a professional gym, but the complex has got something at least. And we'll also take you out to the pool area of the complex. Up these stairs here, and they will take you to the pool area. Here is the pool area of the actual unit. Now just across the road there, that there is Kedron Wavell Services Club. And to the right here is the Chermside Library. I'll just make my way back down. This complex has a sauna area. Sauna area for the property. The complex also has toilets and shower around the side, a barbecue area, and this here is the rear gate access to get across to the library. That's the Chermside Library there. Directly down that road there is a pool area or a public pool. And that's the Kedron Wavell Services Club. Making our way back to the entrance of the building. And once again, you'll need key access to get into the building. Back to the foyer area. And we'll make our way over to the lift and go up to the level here which is we're going to level eight hopping into the lift and you'll need a security swipe system here security swipe system to get up to the designated level we're going to so we're going to level eight we are in this particular unit here so with a middle unit and there's a total of six units on this particular floor here and we're on playfield street side but while we're here i'm just going to show you where the rubbish bin chute is, so you put your rubbish down here. Obviously you don't put large boxes or anything down here. But hey, beat running always down to the bin every every day with your rubbish. Okay, let's step on into 806 15 Playfield Street. Wow! This is a great two bedroom, one bathroom apartment with a little study nook. Apartment on the top level of the complex. This is just showing you the living area. That's through to the bathroom, back towards the entrance, and the kitchen area. So I'll just start on the, uh, the kitchen here. With that fridge space there, you can definitely get a fridge in there with a height of 175 centimetres, just so you're aware of that. Uh, you've got a gas stove hub, a range hood up the top there, just so you know these things slide out. And the oven down bottom here with a dishwasher, 
stainless steel sink, a microwave space there on the right hand side and plenty of pantry space. Just moving around to the lounge room, just notice up in the top right hand corner there you've got a air conditioner, reverse cycle air conditioner and then just down to the side there you've also got a little study nook. So there's the study nook, just through there um, you can just see the toilet. We'll make our way back to the entrance of the property and you can see there's plenty of linen space or cupboard space just here on the right hand side and now we're going to step into the family bathroom. It's the only bathroom in the property. So we have a shower here and then you can see the uh, vanity cupboard with the mirrors up top here and I'll just open this up for you. I love these cupboards here because these mirrors because you can actually store items in here. That's a fantastic idea. And looking down towards the laundry area and you've got a dryer with the property as well. Intercom comes in handy to buzz people up from downstairs and you can buzz them up the lift as well. So let's just make our way outside here. Now this is looking directly at Chermside. Nice, beautiful, elevated views from the top floor here of this apartment here. One of the highest buildings in the area here. So we're just looking down here on Playfield Street, looking north, that's looking west, and looking south. Just over there, if you get hungry, you go across to McDonald's. So really here, this is the main feature of Chermside, so convenient to the Westfield Shopping Centre. Across the road there. It's literally probably a 400 metre walk. You walk out the front entrance of the property here, directly below, you walk across there, along the road, behind that building over there, there's a pathway behind those palm trees there, which takes you across to Westfield Shopping Centre. Where you drive in for this building here, you just drive along the road, and you just drive in to that driveway space just there to take you in under the building to the basement garage. And you can see from this angle here, it's a, a cul-de-sac street as well. So I'll just pan you back around to the unit. That's looking into bedroom number, we'll call it bedroom number one, and looking back towards the kitchen and the lounge and study nook. Let's step into bedroom number one. Has the air conditioning in bedroom number one, as you can see up on top there, with plenty of built-in robe space. And on the left-hand side, I've got the cupboard open for you so you can see the shelving. Now these windows and sliding doors have fly screens. And just looking out the window here, Okay, we'll step back into the lounge room and have a look at the study nook. A reminder, this room has got air conditioning in it. Like a little broom cupboard there. But this little cupboard here also has your, your NBN connected and the safety switch. A toilet. So there's two of you living here, one's in the bathroom. Uh, at least someone can come in and use the, the toilet in the meantime an extra bit of privacy. Coming into bedroom number two, now this room here has a ceiling fan but also it has a private little patio and once again it has built-in robes and it has shelving space as well. So this one here also has fly screens and you can step out. Just a good little area to read a book or have your own peace of mind. And come back in to bedroom number two. So you go from a different perspective, walking through. So bedroom number one has air conditioning, built-in robes, access to the balcony, 
in its own bedroom window. Stepping into the lounge room, looking over towards the kitchen there. And then we've got the family bathroom with the laundry. Okay, I'll take you down to the basement car accommodation now. So we'll go out the door here. And go straight out to the... So this building here has security prop system to get up and down the lift. We're just making our way out to the car accommodation here. This is fairly handy if you do live here. This is the visitor car park for the property. Right down the very end there we have the basement security doors to get in and out of the building. Security camera up on the left hand side there. And this is the driveway that you'd use to get in and out of the building. So we'll just make our way around to the car accommodation for this particular unit. Just down here on the right hand side, just behind this wall here. Really good because it means you've got no neighbour on the right hand side there to uh, hit your car. And then at the back here, you've got this storage area here. This is the basement garage for one car. I'm just going to um, take you on the drive out of the, the building. You've got two methods of getting in and out of the building. You can come in from the left hand side or the right hand side, but this is just going under the basement car park and making your way out via the garage door here and it'll just pop up automatically for you. Really exciting video this one here, but at least you know your way around the building uh, to get in and out. And as we drive around here, this is the visitor car park. And we're just going to get over here towards the left here. And we're going to exit the building, going up on the left hand side. Um, but if we wanted to go back in under the building, we'll just go straight ahead over to the right hand side there. Straight through. Straight through there. Okay, but we're going to exit the building now. Going up to the main road. And we're coming out onto Playfield Street now. Please contact me directly should you require further information or if you would like to arrange a time to personally inspect the property.